The new Call of Duty uh, Season 6 is out, and I was more interested to see exactly what it was offering. I know it was going to be trying to charge me for Nora stuff with micro fees and microtransactions and everything like that, but I wanted to know what the new content was. Slightly confused about why Spawn is the head of this new push they're going now, but I, I guess, you know, it's Halloween... I, I kind of get it. I get the, what I was trying to say, but it, it's more just useless stuff for you to buy. I personally feel it's just useless junk for you to buy. But other than that, another $29 gone, another 27 days. You know, let's do the math of that. That's about nine times a month. What does that give you? Put the, put the math in the comments. It gives you, you know, a bunch of more skins, a bunch of more weapons, things like that. And um, I... I, I I must say I'm underwhelmed. I must would rather pay, I, even if it was something we had to pay every 27 days, it should be $30, man. Come on. 30 bucks is a lot of money to a lot of people. And it's like, we're giving you this $30 all year round. And then on top of that, you're dropping this premium release, air quotations in the air. And I got to give you another $70 to access that. So it's like, Jeez, Louise, bro. So you do two of those a month. Plus, I mean, I'm paying you like $400 a year just to be involved in this world. And it just gets old. Just for new skins, even though that skin is dope. You know, I, uh, I, I just, I don't know, man. I feel like, I don't want to say they're taking advantage of us because we could just choose to stop playing. But at the same time, it is getting expensive. This is getting expensive. Between paying all my money out to be a Call of Duty guy and it taking up all the space on whatever console you're playing on is like they don't want you to play anything else. So I'm hoping maybe Microsoft will slow this down or maybe they'll speed it up. I don't know. I'm not a Microsoft expert. I can only assume they're just as money grubbing as the rest of them are. But it's here now. You have different skins. You have different uh, uh, emotes you can get. You have different emblems you can get, different guns you can get. Uh, they have the uh, ISO um, 9 millimeters out now. Okay, you can run around with this little sickle thing too, but I'm just, when does the charging stop is more of the question. When does the charging stop? How much are we going to be charged until it breaks and people stop? Then what is Activision's plan after that? I mean, people are already leaking out and going to all these weird side games that are obviously not as good as Call of Duty, but there's no pays. So they're losing people to that. So it's like, wh why are you keep doing it, man? I don't, I don't know. You comment at the bottom if you think you're happy the new season is out. You comment at the bottom if it should be seasons. You comment at the bottom if you played the old Call of Duty back in the day and it wasn't this much. Do you think it went up? I mean, what do you think? I, I don't know. To me, it's like... I'm going to pay it because I have to. I don't have no choice because then there's the pay to win. If I don't pay it, I'm sorry. I feel like my hits mean less. Am I wrong for feeling that way? My hits mean less. You know, when I watch the winners of each game, they all have battle passes. And, you know, how would you know that? I mean, you can tell by the skins they're wearing. They all have battle passes. Or if I don't pay you, then my tokens don't mean anything. I don't ever progress. I'm just playing in a circle. So it's like. I don't know. That's just how I feel. I feel like here we are again. Here we are again. And I'm, I'm not angry at it. It's just a, a point of conversation. And, and then on top of that, you know, the DMZ situation. DMZ was beta for a minute. It, you know, it, it was this, it was that. But now I think that's good. They're going to start charging for it separately. It's going to, they have, they have the premium. So, you know, what does that mean? What does DMZ premium mean? Honestly, like, I don't know, man. Y'all tell me. I'm just maybe just rambling here, but just just keep a watch out for it. It's dropping. I mean, I mean, just keep a watch out for it, what they're going to charge you, man, and understand what you're willing to pay out, man. Don't don't give these people too much money, man. Don't give them too much money is, is my message.